Hi everybody. Um, I had to make a video today. I didn't. I didn't have a lot of time today, but I decided because I was so inspired by these carrot stalks. Look, isn't that gorgeous. I thought, wow, these carrots must be really healthy to have such gorgeous stalk. It must be their hair, like our hair, but we eat properly. Look how gorgeous nature grows and we grow right i mean gorgeous so i'm gonna choose a lot of stuff today for some reason my body is craving greens and i eat a lot of salads but that takes a lot of time and i need to go get an appointment today uh, or go to my appointment today so i got some bok choy this is really amazing because in germany you know this is the first time i think i've seen bok choy in the late last year, eight years that I've been here. You know, you usually eat these, you know, saute them in oyster sauce or, you know, soy sauce with sesame oil and things like that. But I'm gonna juice these. I, I saw a video of, of a girl juicing bok choy or putting them in a green smoothie. And I'm gonna try to juice these gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous greens and see what happens. Um, greens, you know, is a great way to detoxify. I ate a lot this weekend. I went to um, a little function. They had like amazing fish and you know, salads, and I ate mostly really well. But I just feel a little bogged down, bogged down. So I have oranges, grapefruit, carrots, carrots from the stalk, bok choy, um, cucumbers. So here I love putting a bunch of vegetables in this. Big punch bowl, isn't that gorgeous? Um, and I'm gonna juice these and then um, I'm gonna drink it all before I go to my doctor's appointment. So, um, thanks for watching. Take care of yourselves, do something good for yourself. Um, you know, I've been on this raw fruit journey for a really long time. There are a lot of things that I've experienced that I want to share with you when I have more time, which will be next week. Um, just a few things. You have to eat a lot and you have to combine your foods. I think people who are watching who are more experienced. I noticed that eating uh, cashew butter. I made cashew butter. Uh, I ate a lot of gazpacho, a lot of different vegetables in, in a, a cold soup. And it really filled me up and it had, I didn't have any cravings. But then yesterday, I didn't eat that much, and I had a little bit of fish over the weekend and things like that, and it sort of threw me off because I was doing about 90, 90% raw. Um, and, you know, when you don't eat, eat enough or when you're eating things that's not really nutritionally, you know, satisfying to your brain and your body and you're not getting enough liquids because you do have vitamins in your body. It's just that you need a transport. Water is a transport. Um, you know, juices are transport. So you've got to drink lots of liquids. And if you don't, you're going to crave things that are bad for you. I mean, come on, we know that they're bad for you. They taste good. But then when you're really raw and you're clean and you look at the foods that you use, you're used to eating, like junk food, hamburgers and tacos, things like that, somehow they have you have a strange, um, I don't know, they look strange, they look alien almost that you see people eating them. When you do eat really clean and like 80, 90% raw, you don't want those things. But then when you're not feeding your body enough vitamins or let, you know, distributing all the vitamins that's already in your body through liquids and juices, fresh juices, greens, you're gonna want those things, okay? So be careful and do that first thing in the morning or when you have time. Even five, ten minutes, you know, go to the store, get, get a, a juice or a juice bar. In America, it's a mecca of amazing restaurants, raw cafes, juice bars, and things like that. I don't have that luxury, so I have to do it at home. I mean, there are a few, but then, you know, I have to drive a really long time to get there. But anyway, have a great day, and I'm going to drink my juice and go to my appointment. See you soon.